A woman who was struggling to get unemployment benefits just a few years ago decided to open her own business last year, and now she wants to give back to the community. 23 ABC's Mark Christian has been following her story from unemployment to job search, turned business owner, and now to helping others. This video is from 2009, after Juanita Bradshaw got laid off from her job and was getting nowhere with her unemployment benefits. I'd like to find out the status of my claim. Bradshaw then contacted 23ABC, and we got her in contact with someone at the Employment Development Department who could help. Your station provided me with um, resources to contact them, and so I was able to get through and I was able to receive unemployment. Then she started receiving her benefits. But after several months of looking for work and going back to school to get her master's degree, a job was nowhere to be found. Um, I realized the only way that I was going to work is to buy my own job. So after losing about 100 pounds, this woman of faith decided to sell her old clothes to help make ends meet, which turned out to be successful. Pretty much anything that you would need to, um, you know, uh, dress for any occasion. And last year, she officially opened Fashion Plus Size on North Chester, which sells new and used plus size clothes for men and women. It has been amazing. The growth has been phenomenal. I'm, I look around and I am literally, I'm, I'm in awe to see, you know, what, uh, you know, what a mighty God can do. I'm in awe. Now, it started off as the clothes from her personal closet became the catalyst to open the store. Now she's taking those clothes to give back to the community. We have a drawing. Uh, for someone to come in and I want to dress them for an interview. Good morning. Welcome. Bradshaw is going to give a job interview outfit to one person a month to help in their job search. I want to help as many people as I can while I can. So anyone who is plus size and looking for work can stop by her shop and drop off their resume and she'll draw one name for the free outfit. She says she's doing this to give back because she's been there, done that. I know how hard it was for me, you know, and especially after I had lost all the weight. I didn't even have any clothes and couldn't even afford to buy any clothes. North of the River, Mark Christian, 23 ABC. And if you have a story idea that you think we should know about, we'd like to hear it. You can email us at news at kero.com or call our newsroom at 637-2320. What a success story, really? love oh, that. Yeah, about three years we've been following yeah. her story. Getting better all the time. Oh, good for her. All right, what if you could